You know when life gives you lemon? You make lemonade. You make... Oh, that's what you're supposed to do? Welcome back to Wonderful Stays Home Tour. My name is Brian. And I'm Hung. We're here in Sunnyvale, California, taking a look at the Elevation in Sunnyvale community by Taylor Morrison. This is the last model we're going to see, and we're going to take a look at the corner unit of Residence 2 condo. It is a three-story, three-bedroom, three-and-a-half bath, two-car garage in a 1,790-square-feet home with a starting price of $1,513,000 and an an HOA of approximately $350 per month. If you guys are interested in real estate, looking for homes in the Bay Area, or need some interior design ideas, come on this tour with us. Let's go. Hmm. Whoa. I was like, how come it's not turning on? Two feet, this is nice. This is nice and sizable. With a little storage area. I like that all the panels and stuff are down here. So if you ever need someone to come work on it, they don't have to go through your home. Pretty cool. Oh, this is a lot to read. Oh, door opens on its own. Sounds like a ghost thing, huh? A crystal geyser. <laughs> oh, shoot, my bad. They made this into an interesting office. For once, for once, it's not a MacBook 2 2020. It's a PC. Yeah, it's actually a PC now. Kind of cool. What do you mean that? Oh. <laughs> Some stuff, maybe. I've been leaving a lot more uh, walk in closet. Not too bad, not too big, not too small. Here's your... Interesting, there's no door. Here's your sink. Because the door is where the bathroom is actually at. Yeah. Oh. You're facing the street in this case too, right? So it's kind of a little weird. I guess you need blinds for sh Oh, you definitely need blinds. Your shower area. And your toilet area. I like their... Toilet paper holder down. Yeah, so you're facing outside. Yeah, let them see what you're doing. Yeah, I guess so. More stuff to edit out. No, that's not bad. The room is okay, huh? Like it, like it was made to be uh, an office, right? Yeah. But now you have that shower space, so it's kind of a little weird, right? Shower there. Yeah. Yeah. And this could be like your IT closet. If you make this your actual um, office office. Ladies first. Thank you. <laughs> Again. They have this. Just like the previous one. A lot of Why? I guess it's better than nothing, right? Yeah. Or a table. A lot of lemons. You know when life gives you lemon? You make lemonade. You make... Oh, that's what you're supposed to do? What do you mean? I thought you eat it with her. <laughs> you should do that too. Oh, oh dude. What? I went to fucking long. Yeah. It was so good. I haven't had pho. In a while, huh? I had to sit down and eat. I was like, oh man. No, that, that place is really popular. Yeah. 
They did. They redid the whole interior. Like more space, I guess, now because it's yeah. super crowded, right? Yeah. Hey, but don't say it too fast. Yeah. It's actually really good. Yeah, but there's always like a, a wait, but the wait is not long. Because uh, it's like Vietnamese fast food, right? Yeah. Oh, it was so delicious. Did your girlfriend like it? Does she like Vietnamese food? Yeah. We were craving it. One night. One night? After a walk through the Great Mall. Great Mall? Yeah. Ah, how's the Great Mall like now? Dead. Dead? Really? Ah, interesting. So a lot of repeats uh, of these house. And here's the trash area actually. Right in front of your house. So hopefully it doesn't stink. The kitchen is kind of small, huh? Uh -huh. The island is kind of small. Is it real? Yeah. Plastic. At least they have a coffee machine. Oh, the water is actually running? No. So why is it dripping then? Ah, oh, that's a lot of waste of water, huh? Uh -huh. That's why we have a drought. At least it stopped. Alright, um... Honey. Oh. I don't, yeah, I don't really like how they didn't finish up the cabinet all the way up, huh? At least there's nice big windows here. Nice big window. Overall, it's okay. It's bigger than the one we saw earlier, but similar. Should we do another wonderful stays intro with mask on? Up we go. Up and up. So this is a corner or uh, unit, so it's a little bigger. Okay, at least this is right. This is how it should be. Side to side with cabinets. I'll leave it for you. Whoa. This is actually kind of a nice painting picture. Looks like... Yeah. It's kind of cool. Your... The view is pretty nice, right? Just the negative is you're right next to the trash can. You think it's gonna stink? Probably, Hold huh? Not. Hold not. Nice. This is extreme, extremely similar to the one we saw earlier, uh -huh. but it feels darker because the color is darker, I guess. Yeah. Yeah. There's nothing in behind. A nice um, long-standing shower, though. Really nice. Nice hallway. I don't know, the big bedroom, huh? Or the window, sorry. And the windows to the side. The size of the nightstand is really nice. 
Yeah, especially over for a better view. You can kind of see the mountains over there. Hmm. I wonder if you can put something here. Like plants? Maybe. Probably, huh? Well, there's a, a nail there, at least. <laughs> Someone forgot it. Regular closet. Regular. Yeah, so this is closer to what you get because this is not a model home exactly. You get all, you don't have that nice chandelier, for example. You don't have all these upgrades. So this is really close to what you actually get unless you want to upgrade it yourself or have to build or upgrade it. And you see how the door doesn't have the mirror? This is actually how you get the door. Uh, of course, you can always replace the door with a mirror at once. Looks more plain, right? Mm -hmm. Compared to the model, obviously, because there's probably at least $10,000 worth of upgrades, mm -hmm. excluding furniture. Mm -hmm. The paint is kind of glossy, kind of. And the tiles is pretty normal. Because mm -hmm. the other one was wood, right? Mm -hmm. Wood looking. Not yeah. At least the windows are still pretty big and sizable. Mm -hmm. All right. Anything else? All right, Brian. What do you think of Residence Two? There are a couple interior design ideas that I like, and one I don't like. So let's talk about the one I don't like first. When you come upstairs to the second floor, you see the small dining table, and it fits the whole in the area it's in because the dining area is small as well. So the size doesn't really make me excited about the area, like the size in the dining area of the other home we just toured. What I do like about the interior designs of the home is one, the family room area, the metallic coffee table. That was an eye catcher for me. I like how if a light would shine on it, it would reflect some light and yeah, it would just catch your eye. The other thing I like are the bar stool chairs around the island. It adds a nice pop to the area, especially the chair seats are white, which is a bright color and goes against the dark cabinet color as well so the contrast you can see is there those are the things that I like Hong what about you what I like about this house is that it's a corner unit home when you buy a corner unit home you get more windows and it helps make the house a lot brighter another thing I really like about this house is that the internet cables and the breakers are in the garage versus spread out throughout your house so that way it's much easier if you need someone to come in to upgrade a circuit or if you switch internet companies don't have to really go into your house to do it the last thing I like about this community is that they have a shared trash area so that means you don't need trash bins in your home that you have to bring out every week and you can throw away your smelly trash each day which is a big convenience but this home is next to the communal trash can so on a hot day if you open your windows you might actually smell the trash but hopefully you don't but that's the, the iffy thing about this home hope you guys liked the tour and enjoyed our time at the Elevation and Sunnyvale community if you liked the video don't forget Get to hit the like button we are going to revisit a previous community on monday orchard heights they have two new model homes compared to when we visited last time have a good weekend see you guys on monday